everyone, welcome to Ecoholics. In this video, we are going to discuss about the types of elasticity of demand, right? Now, let's get started. <coughs> the first question that arises is, what is elasticity of demand? So, it is simply the degree of responsiveness. So, it is the degree of responsiveness. Now, what does this mean? This means that when the price or the consumer's income or the price of the related good, so the price of the related good would be substitutes or complements. So, when the price, consumer's income, price of related good changes by what or to what extent? Right. To what extent are quantity demanded going to change? To what extent are quantity demanded going to change? This is what is elasticity of demand. Now, let's look at the types of elasticity of demand. So, we have three types. First is price elasticity of demand. Second is cross elasticity of demand and third is income elasticity of demand. Now, we are going to look at them one by one. Now, what is price elasticity of demand? So, it is the percentage change in quantity demanded because of a percentage change in price. So, we know that Humne law of demand padai, right? The law of demand mein humne kya padai? Ki ek inverse relationship rehta hai price and quantity demanded mein. Thik hai? Now, Inverse relationship ka simple meaning hai ki jab price badhta hai to there is fall in quantity demanded and vice versa that is agar price fall hota hai to quantity demanded hamara rise hota hai to ye hamara law of demand batata hai lekin price ke change hone se hamare quantity demanded mein kitna farak aayega that is to what extent a quantity demanded going to change is what is elasticity of demand. That is the price elasticity of demand to be precise. Okay, so when we talk about the extent, then our concept comes from elasticity of demand. Okay, so this is what is price elasticity of demand. Now, let's look at the formula for price elasticity of demand. The formula for price elasticity of demand is the percentage change in quantity demanded divided by the percentage change in price. Now, how can we write this? This can also be written as This can also be written as Delta Q by Q divided by Delta P by P. Now, further simplifying this, what do we get? Delta Q by Q into P by Delta P. Is ko or further simplify karne ke baad hume kya milta hai? This will be Delta Q by Delta P into P by Q. Ye hamara price elasticity of demand ka final equation hai, final formula hai. So, 
So this is our formula for price elasticity of demand. Now, price elasticity of demand में दो concepts हमें पहले समझने की Let's understand two important concepts. That is, what is inelastic and what is elastic demand. अब inelastic और elastic क्या है? Now, let's understand this with help of an example. Let's say, अगर जो हमारा price है, वो 10% से राइस करता है एंड हमारा जो क्वांटिटी डिमांडेड है लेट से वो सिर्फ फाइव परसेंट से फॉल कर रहे हैं मतलब अ क्वांटिटी डिमांडेड चेंजेस बाय अ स्मॉलर परसेंटेज देन डज द प्राइस मतलब इस केस में क्या हुआ कि प्राइस तो हमारा टेन परसेंट से बढ़ रहा है लेकिन क्वांटिटी डिमांडेड में उतना ज्यादा फर्क नहीं आ रहा है तो इस केस में हम बोलते हैं कि हमारा जो डिमांड है वो है इनइलास्टिक नाउ सिमिलरली दूसरे केस में लेट से आ प्राइस राइजेस बाय टेन परसेंट प्राइस हमारा टेन परसेंट से राइज होता है लेकिन जो हमारा क्वांटिटी डिमांडेड है वो लेट से ट्वेंटी परसेंट से फॉल होता है मतलब प्राइस तो सिर्फ टेन परसेंट से बढ़ा लेकिन जो क्वांटिटी डिमांडेड है उसमें ट्वेंटी परसेंट का फॉल है इसका मतलब ये है कि ये जो डिमांड है सो so इसका मतलब ये है कि ये जो डिमांड है वो है इलास्टिक मतलब द क्वांटिटी डिमांडेड चेंजेस बाय अ ग्रेटर परसेंटेज देन डज द प्राइस सो so, ये इंपॉर्टेंट कॉन्सेप्ट है इनइलास्टिक एंड इलास्टिक डिमांड का 